Welcome to the Hi T S420 Passport Photo System Tutorial brought to you by CFS. The first step is setting up the printer. Plug in the power cord and attach the hand controller to the back of the printer. Hang the hand controller from the post on the left front of the printer. Push down on the ribbon door button and load an ink ribbon cartridge with the orange end at the top left and the arrows pointing left. Insert the left side first so that the spring-loaded spindles align with the rollers. Make sure the exposed ribbon film does not have excess slack in it. Once in place, close the S420's front door. Next. Power on the printer with the rear switch. Be sure to only handle the S420's paper by the perforated side strips. Open the paper tray by lifting on the curved edge. Insert the paper sheets with the blank glossy side facing up. Open the printer's lower door and slide the paper tray open side first all the way until it stops. Plug in the larger end of the camera's USB cable. Passport photos require a white background, so here we're using the freestanding photo backdrop, also available from CFS. Position your subject as close against the backdrop as possible to minimize shadows. Compose the picture in the camera's viewfinder from the mid shoulders up. Make sure there is only white space to the sides and above the head, then take the picture. Next, connect the camera to the printer with the USB cable and wait a few seconds for it to be recognized. Now use the hand controller's oval directional control buttons to select the ID photo mode in the upper right and press the OK button. Next, select the 2x2 A size and press OK. Press the OK button to confirm the two identical photos format. Use the oval directional controls to select the photo you'd like to print. Then press the OK button. After the image loads, you may need to modify it. To rotate the image, move to the second icon on the top and press OK. Then rotate using the directional pad and press OK. If the subject's nose is not aligned under the center grid line, select the Move icon in the upper left and press OK. Adjust the position using the directional pad and then press OK. To finalize the image, navigate to the OK icon in the lower right and press the OK button. Now all that's left to do is press the print button. The sheet will pass through the printer four times, once for yellow, once for magenta, once for cyan, and the final for a clear overcoat. It takes about 78 seconds for your print to be complete. Once it's done, you've got two identical photos measuring 2 by 2 inches, complete with crop marks. So that's it for our quick overview on how to use the Hi-T S420 Digital Passport Photo System. As always, if you have any questions, you can go to www.cfsbindingsupplies.com or email them to us at info at cfsbindingsupplies.com. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.